y'all, it's me, your gal Sal, and we're back with my beautiful paper smile. We left off with having a knife and having to watch over the campfire, so let's get right back into it. Okay, so we're keeping watch over the campfire. I had, have, no idea where I'm supposed to be keeping a watch. Where I'm supposed to go. Do I go out this gate? I can't go out any gate, so what am I keeping an eye out for? I'm so confused. So let's walk around this property and try to figure out if there's anything that we can interact with or how we're supposed to keep an eye out for bad guys. Bad guys. Still can't do anything with the well. Can I go like all the way over here? Is there an all the way over here to go to? Oh, I wonder if I should go down that trail. There's a gate over here. Maybe I should try going through the gate. Maybe this time it'll let me through. <gasps> yes, yes it will. Let us be on our way. I hear something. What is that? That's really kind of creepy. Okay, so let's keep it moving. Oh God, is it that creepy laughing thing again? Listen, I got a knife. I'm prepared to use it. I am fully Whoa. Whoa, what is that in the distance? What is going on up there? Why do I do this? Okay, so I guess we're gonna just, you know. Oh, wait, look at the shiny floor. <gasps> And probably die. We're probably just gonna die right away. I'm I'm just dead. Gone. My life snuffed out like a vapor. I hear something. What be this? When summoning the spirits of those perished, one must make an offering of life to appease the dead. You will need a source of life. Typically carried in a lantern, but other sources are acceptable. Bring the life close to the orbs, and a portion will be transferred to the orb. If an orb is lit unintentionally, you must extinguish the source of life. If an object that is lacking life comes close to an orb, it will absorb the life from the orb, leaving the orb empty once again. I have a life that gives me light. Is that telling me what I'm supposed to do? Hmm. Oh, a token. What kind of token was that? Oh, it's a diamond token. Oh, holy crap. What is that noise? Oh, I unintentionally lit the orb? Oh, and that stuff will still come after me. Okay. So do I need to like light both of these? Is that what I needed to do? I'm just kind of wondering. Oh. Okay. So, I guess I'm just kind of lighting stuff. Oh, there's more orbs. <laughs> okay. I'm just lighting orbs. You know, that's that's what I'm doing. 
Are there any more orbs to light up? Will this hurt me giving away a little bit of my life source? I just want to know. What is this? Oh. Oh, that tells me what, how they have to be lit. <gasps> Interesting. So I need to unlight the one on the right, left, and right. To get the spirit of the faceless. Oh, okay. So let's then go over here. And we'll take that off. Okay. Hang on, because we're going to have to put it back on so we don't die. And then come over here. Snuff that one out. And come over here and snuff that one out. <gasps> oh, oh, we did it. What is happening? Whoa, why do you summon me yet again? I have told everything I have the desire to share. Wait now, you are no authority. It is I, the lost child. I did not expect to see you here so soon. You must know that the authorities are searching the land for you. They have summoned many spirits to gain help and information in an effort to find you. They will take no chances in letting you travel freely. I will prepare a path to the king for you. Continue on your way and all will be in order. As long as you keep away from the beings of the forest. Like the spidery thing? You have nothing to fear. I must leave you now. Journey safely, child. Oh, whoa. Whoa, achievement unlocked, cultist. Well. Well, 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 well. I'm just going to go back on my merry way. Yeah, that's, I mean, that was, that was definitely an experience. So the, the orb, the, the lost child is going to prepare a pathway for me and tells me just to keep away from the beings of the forest. Hi, that's just a tree, nothing to be afraid of. It's okay. What? I'm sorry, what? I will cut you up. That must have been like some kind of a, a temple or something. It had to have been. Is the hunter outside by the fire? No. There's the hunter right there. I have rested and have prepared myself for the remainder of our journey. How was your watch? Hunter, I really do believe that a creature follows us. I have told you already that you have nothing to fear. I alone shall keep you from harm. I know the path ahead of us like you know the back of your beautiful mask. Now let us travel once again. Beginning to think this hunter guy is not who he makes himself out to be. And how come he gets to open all the gates? That's not fair. Whoa, hi. Let's catch up with this person. Uh-oh. Now what? Atop the tower lies someone who can help us gather the blood of evil. The structure's entrance is likely locked, so search vigilantly for a key. I have a key. Oh, I need to search for a key in here. Ooh.
Here's a token. Hmm. Looking for a key? A key? Oh, what's this? Whoa! <gasps> Found him! Can I cut this one too? Aw, oh, hex yeah. Can I cut other stuff? Oh, I like this. I like this a lot. Okay, even though the, you know, the meat slab was kind of a thing. What's this? Oh. Just, you know, cutting down meat and stuff. Alright, let's find the hunter. We've got the key. No. Oh, yes. Yes, yes, yes. What is this? Go inside with him, kid. Don't just, you know, stay outside in the dark. A creature lies inside this crate. Oh, great. Why is it always a creature? It frowns always. It is saddened and everything. It does everything behind a cloak of depression. It will give us a drop of its blood, for it wishes to see the king fall. If it questions you, do not let it know that you are one of the joyous. Okay, I will not say anything. Uh... It's empty. He is gone. Did you not speak of a creature wandering under the trees of the forest? Yes, I did. We must leave immediately. I will keep watch at the next cabin. Lovely. He didn't believe us before, but he believes us now. This guy. After you finish resting, it won't be long before we reach the village. I am quite eager to arrive there, so I will now enter the cabin. Before you do, I must comment on your smile. I'm sorry, what? It is ravishing. Beautiful. Each tooth is molded with such delicacy. Something is not right about this. Something is not right about this. <laughs> okay. I mean to ask you if I may wear it. I cannot remove it, for whenever I make such an attempt, I see terrible pictures in my eyes. They couldn't be so frightening that you would never take it off. I have helped you so much, child. My smile cannot be removed. Oh, crap balls. I have led you all the way across this kingdom, even you have no desire to help me in return. You do not need to smile. Oh, come on! Give it to me. Take it off. Whoa! Whoa! And... Whoa? Sleep well, my child. What was that? I don't understand! He did the, the creepy, glitchy, twisty thing that that other thing did when I... Killed it in the mask room. Is it the same thing? Oh, this game is so confusing. You are a creepy dude. Creepy dude. Whoa, hi, look at that. It's one of those things with some butcher knives in it. That's not at all alarming. That does not scream. Error. Is that just going outside? Well, let me in there. All right, well, I guess let's take a rest. Ooh. 
Oh, the mask. Always gets me. I am brimming with fear this night. What can I do now that might progress me in my mission to find my friend? Still, I require the blood of evil to make my name. But I now doubt that the hunter was, was truthful about its creation. He makes me feel unsafe. I desire to journey to the village without him, and I believe we are close enough to the king that I can find my way alone. But if he speaks in good taste about my needing a name, I must somehow find a creature of sadness from which I can pull blood. I wish that the lost child could help me, but I know he isn't following me closely. He has failed to make himself known even in my moments of distress. The hunter has failed to help me obtain everything needed for my name. I feel I must make a decision at this time. Oh, I have to choose? I can let the hunter help me finish my name and lead me to the village. Or I can draw blood from the hunter for use in my name and leave him. Oh, what am I going to do? What should I do? He was glitchy and I don't trust him. Let's take his blood. I will awaken to gather the blood of evil this night. Somehow the face just turned creepy. you kid the blood of perfection I have a blood of perfection two items added to inventory hunter's blood blood taken from the neck of the hunter it will be used to create your name and a crescent token Oh, this kid. Oh, this kid. How do I get out of here? I have a feeling I just... Oh, wait, that's the facility, I think, up there. Do I leave this way? Oh, my God, I just killed that guy. How do I know if I made the right choice? I don't know if I made the right choice. I am so... <laughs> I am so confused. Oh, wow. No, I can't leave back that way, so this is the right way to go. Oh, my goodness. You know what? I can either sit here and be upset about my choice and question it or I can just go with it and be confident in my choice and I think that's what I'm going to do. Be confident in my choice. I wasn't I wasn't planning on murdering him though. <laughs> but no, I'm confident in my decision. Fully confident. <clears throat> confident. I believe in my decision to get that hunter's blood and then take all of his possessions off of him. Oh my, what be this? Entering Eden? Entering Eden, what does this say? Fountain of the Spirit, five triangle inscribed tokens will awaken the water. Do I have triangle inscribed tokens? I only have four. 
So that sucks for me. Fountain of the Father. Four diamond inscribed tokens will awaken the water. I have three diamond inscribed and four triangle, but I don't have enough for the others. So can I gather one more? Are there, are there more coins in here that I can gather? I hope so. Because I wouldn't be sure how to go through and try to find more. What is this? Three crescent inscribed tokens will awaken the water. Fountain of the sun, the father, the son, and the spirit. Oh, this took on a really strange religious connotation. Okay. Oh, that's water going through there. I see. Well, let me take a quick look-see around here. If I can find any more tokens. And I'm a looking too. Whoa. So that's kind of a bummer. Because I'm not sure how I would have to go back and search for any more tokens. Oh, a barrel tipped over. Okay, no more tokens over here. Oh. I'm not ready to go that way yet. What be all this? Can't grab that plank either, so I guess I have no choice but to go through this little cave thing. Oh. Okay. Not sure if I like that sound at all. What is that? This cauldron is full of water. I could mix the ingredients that I have for my name together. First, I'll put in the blood of perfection. Next, the blood of evil. And now my own blood. Amazing. Nothing has happened. There must be something that I am missing. Hmm. I don't know what we could be missing. There might be something here I can use. I should check before I go any further. Oh man, do I have to like go check everything again? There is nothing over here that I can use. Oh, wait a minute. I had to come back out here for something, I guess. An apple? Wait a second. An apple. Why is there an apple in Eden with three fountains and things? Where did that apple go? Item added to inventory. Could it be the last part needed in your name? Well, let's go find out. I don't know. If it's my name going to be Eve? Let's see if this works. We're adding an apple. What? Item added to inventory. I hear my name whispering to me. It, mu it makes many noises and I cannot understand what they tell me. When I next encounter the lost child, I will ask him to decipher these murmurs. Now that I have obtained my name, I can proceed to the village. With luck, this cave may lead me closer to my destination. Oh, look at all the water. Water! Maybe I'll find the rest of the tokens as well. Then I can activate the fountains. That would be pretty cool. But let's make haste. Shall we make haste? 
Oh, wait a minute. It's too quiet. Uh-huh. Exactly what I thought. I'm here. I've got my knife. I'm ready. <gasps> that scared me. I wasn't ready. Okay. Whoa. Whoa. What is happening? I see you have napped well, little one. You should know that it's dangerous to venture through these woods alone. I'd have left you alone if you had stayed further away, but you've entered our domain. My emperor will be truly ecstatic to question your beautiful little smile. I will return to converse with you shortly, child. Well, we're in a pickle, kid. Or a bunch of string. What can I do? Can I do anything? Nope. Oh, I wiggled my way free. Hmm. Oh, they took my knife. Not cool. So not cool. What's in here? If you think I'm just going to stay around. There's my blade right there. And I'm going to put it on me. I hear the creature approaching. kill me? God dang it. I thought I'd had him for sure. Get him, get him, get him, get him. Did I get him? I don't know if I got him. Did we get him, kid? I'm guessing we did. Crap, but now I gotta figure out a way out of here? <sighs> this just does not seem fair. At all. What's over here? Wait, what's over here? Hello? Whoa. That is the scariest looking thing I've ever seen. My son, come closer so I may hear and speak to you. Dude, I will cut you so fast. If the authorities are afoot, then I have no doubt that they claim to locate the child. We may gain some respect in the eye of the king if we give nothing but the boy's corpse back to that filthy beast. This could be a well-deserved strike to his arrogance. How did the child respond to your interrogation? You must think that I am the spider. Please do raise your voice, for I cannot understand what you say. Oh, the child is submissive and answers my questions. Do not force me to pry. Did you find out if the child is a spy? He told me that he became lost in the woods. A likely story. What of his companion? He says that his companion left him. Verify that the child is secure, then search the last cabin they stayed in. But before you go, I have one request. Would you sing your song for your father's tired ears? You know I am weak and in need of comfort these years. Father, my voice is unsure as of late. Smart kid. 
I will leave you to rest. What ails you? Daily, your voice fills these walls with determination and hope. I will sing for you when I return and have learned more about the child. What noise do I hear? Oh, come on, kid. Be quick on your feet. What is this thought that enters my mind? What is my name? Tell me my name. If you are my child, say my name. What have you done to my child? If you go, oh, they are goats. If you goats think you can hold us under your hoof and purge my people, even my own son, then you shall pay a steep price. gonna put his try to stab me with his leg I did oh no oh whoa hi oh you are freaking creepy look at that face look at that face okay oh wow this is very this part it reminds me of the part in limbo where the spider in the woods was trying to stab you with its legs and you had to like Hit his leg, kid. Did he get me again? Oh, this is gonna be hard. Oh, this is gonna be so hard. Okay. Concentrate, Sal. Concentrate, concentrate. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Do we only have to hit his leg one more time? Because it's not like falling off or anything. Oh, we broke that one off. Heck yeah. Hex to the yeah. Now I'm all for the killing. What's going on now? What did we do? Did we kill this dude? Wait, what? Whoa. Whoa, what the heck? How was I killed now? What am I supposed to do? Like hit him with my sword or my knife? Oh, I think I have to like, okay. I think I know what I have to do. I have to drop that thing on him, don't I? Dang, but how am I supposed to do that when it takes so freaking long? Oh, not cool. Not cool at all. He killed me. Can he like not reach me right there? I guess he can't. That's different. That's really different. Like, he can't reach me up here. That is so weird. Well, now that I know that. Ah! He got me once. He got me once. He got me once. Yeah, you keep on laughing there, Spidey. So, let him run. And then, like, go to this one, I guess? 
but come over here first because you can't get me over here. Oh my goodness. With this creepy freaking spider. I wonder what I gotta do. No, it's not letting me do anything over there. Why is that? Why won't it let me do anything over there? What the heck is going on with this game? Okay. So is he going to go stand by the bricks or something now? I am so confused, you guys. I have no idea what's going on. Oh. Okay. Oh, I see, maybe. Okay, so I needed to raise them up higher? Interesting. Let him run around. Okay. Keep it running, old spider. All right, keep it going over here, I guess. Come on, old spider guy. This is going to take a while. Because I have no idea if what I'm even doing is the right thing to do. Got him! Got him! Yes! Oh yeah! Now what do I do? Heck yeah. Get me the hell up out of here. Man, that took way too long. Oh, I've been recording for so long. Oh my god. Oh, come on. There ain't no- oh, I was gonna say, there ain't no way he could be alive after that. Yes. Oh, there's the facility that we should not want to go back to. But where are we going? What is this? We escaped that place. We don't want to go back. Oh, shoot. What is this? Is this the end? Oh, well, it is an early release, so maybe that's not the whole game. Hey, that was, yes, that was Gerbigli in the creepy art that I saw in yesterday, or the episode from the other day, and he confirmed it on Twitter. Yay! Awesome work. Stay tuned for the release of chapters three and four. Yes, I will. The king has awaited your capture for Helix. I couldn't read that other part. He holds ill plans for your soul, but know that we walk your path with you. What? We few have awaited your arrival. We will help you. Oh, this is amazing. Okay, so this is, whoa. Hey, do you intend to leave me now? Leave me again? You can't. You know you can't. Tell me I'm not dead. Tell me you didn't kill me. Lie to me. Tell me your beautiful lies. I wish I could hear you, but I can't. 
you thief. Thief of life. You steal without consideration. I was in need. I am in need. I am always in need. I must have what I need. Take it off. Give it to me. Give it to me! There we go. My beautiful paper smile for at least those chapters because I'm so excited for what is coming. Anyway, my name is Gal Sal and this is my beautiful paper smile. Let me know what you thought. Leave a comment, leave a like, please share, subscribe to the channel if you haven't, if you wanna know what I'm keeping up with. And uh, remember you are important and you are loved. And until next time y'all, 